What's up today, my fellow mass soldiers? So what I'm gonna be doing right now is breaking down for you guys which is the best strategy cards to use for your squad. Also, how you can go about getting these strategy cards, which some of them you're gonna be able to get for free, right? Especially if you're patient. I'm gonna show you guys how to complete sets. And if you guys wanna spend a little bit of money to get these strategy cards, I'm gonna show you guys that way also. So without further ado, let's go ahead and get right into it. So you see right here, we're 92 overall with 93 defense. And I'm gonna be honest with you guys, a big reason why we're 92 overall and our defense is a 93 is because of strategy cards that we use on this squad right because if you're looking at these cards they're not really that high of an overall they're only looking a little bit higher because they're boosted up with blue cans thanks to the strategy cards that i use for my squad right so look at creed humphrey the center 91 overall playmaker 94 overall josh allen straight strategy cards he's a 92 overall boosted up to a 94 overall let's go ahead and check out the defense now minka fitzpatrick he's up to a 95 overall he's only a 93 overall then we got isaiah palamu he's up to a 92 overall then you got benjamin up two overall so some of these players are up two overalls or up one overalls but the main thing is because of their overalls boosted up that's what house out my team overall go up even higher and it's not even just the overall it makes them more juiced up just based on the fact um, that their, their attributes are juiced up. So when you're online, look at this guy. He got 99 zone. That's going to make a big difference with that 99 press, 93 play rec. That's going to help out this card a lot and being much more effective when it comes out there and we're, and we're out there grinding, right, when it comes to the gameplay. Strategy cards, the, the best strategy cards for your team right now, if you guys want to run them, is going to be this letter rip, which is a legendary card, and it's in the zone um def defensive legendary card i'm sorry this is the offense legendary card and defensive legendary card and what i like about these go ahead and compare because they'll show us a better view it gives it says qb it boosts up your qb and o-line that's what my qb um mostly is juiced up right and then my o-line is a little bit juiced up also plus three throw power plus three impact blocking and plus three deep accuracy right so some a lot of you guys actually you know some of you guys may know about that but the thing is there's other things that, that's also good to know, which I'm going to share with you guys right now. And then this in the zone for your defensive backs, it gives you plus four zone, plus three play rec, and plus two press. Okay, now, see, it gives you plus four zone, but I got it to where it gives me plus five zone, what makes it even more OP, as you can see, when it comes to my cornerbacks. And the reason why, you want to make sure, let me go ahead and back out, because I want to show you guys real quick. If you want to get that extra plus zone, you want to make sure when you, when you get this let it rip one make sure you get the let it rip one with the you see that little that little circle with there you want to make sure that you get that to where i'm sorry i'm not sorry not the circle yeah the little circle with the like the little half mark you want to make sure because that's the end of zone symbol so that that is actually giving the plus zone to your defense i know that's crazy that the offensive card is boosting up your defense but it is that little circle with the little half in the middle and that little arrow pointing to that little half that means that means in the zone that's the end of zone chemistry it's actually giving a plus one and so i, I was i was told it's supposed to get plus two but it does give the plus one so that's why we're able to get plus five zone when it comes to our defensive backs to let you guys know that and when it comes to the throw power we're able to get that extra throw power because you see that little strong arm right there the guy doing the little strong arm when it comes to your in the zone one you want to get the one with the little strong arm because that's going to give you plus one's uh throw power so that's going to be plus five uh, throw power all together which is i'm sorry i'm sorry not plus five plus four is uh because it gets three plus three throw power so give them plus one so give them plus four throw power to your qb so that's what makes them makes them more effective and also boosts the overall of his card now let me go ahead and back out right if you guys want to know how to get them for free i'm gonna go ahead and tell you guys real quick we're gonna go over here to your your seasons your season pass you're gonna you're gonna go over here for you guys don't know go to your daily objectives in your daily objectives which i'm going to do today you're going to get a strategy card as well as a coin pick a uh, quick sell and just so you guys know i actually put i actually pulled the legendary card i did it one time but i actually got one i pull rare here and there but every single day at least you're going to get a common one and you let though look at as we're speaking about it we're going to open it right now just because we're speaking about it, see what we get so we get an uncommon one that's cool because i'm gonna complete some sets right now for you guys so i can show you guys how to do it and also check out the auction house so that's how you do it complete your daily objectives you're gonna get one a day you're gonna pull an uncommon one guaranteed but you could pull an uncommon one a rare one and also a legendary one so start getting those and what i do is i let them save up right i let them save up we're gonna go here and go to my strategy before i actually complete some sets so you can see how much i got so these two right here no doubt in my mind i bought them just to let you guys know that 
but these other ones are here. I got them for free for completing solos as well as doing like my season pass. I think I got a few, but you see them right here though. So these right here, I'm gonna actually use to complete some sets and I'm gonna show you guys how you can go about getting some, right? Just by completing the sets. So I don't know why it did that. So I basically have to put it in. So, oh, it, oh, it don't even let me put it in. So let's go to program, is it core items? Yeah, yeah, so here's the strategy right here. So we got rare, we got uncommon, and we got, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Rare, uncommon, and then these are the epic one, right? So we're gonna go ahead and we're gonna do an uncommon one. We're gonna see what we pull real quick. We're gonna go ahead and do that. I'm not tripping on which one I use because I already got the three main ones in my lineup. So if I, I there's not one that I, I really care for not using. So this is how this is how I go about getting my stuff. If you want to get some for free, plus two man zone and plus one press. I actually will help out your squad. It may not help it out a hundred percent, but it actually helps it out. Like if we even get another one. Look at that, another uncommon one. Let's go ahead and get that. Cause we got quite a bit and see what we pull right here and then i use these uncommon ones to pull a rare and then i use the rare ones to pull an epic one just to let you guys know that so this is paved the way not bad not bad so we're done with that now we're going to do the rares we see what we pull out the rare and after we're done with the rare we're going to pull an epic we can't pull we can't we can't there's not a legendary set right now to let you guys know but we could pull up to an epic so that's actually cool so at least you'll be able to get something so here's a rare uh, boosts up the middle linebacker strong safety so also right like to me i like the end of zone because it, it you get the most when it comes to to your team but if you guys just want to boost up your d line or middle linebackers and stuff like that there's strategy cards for it right so get the best ones for your team but to me to get the most out of it you want the q uh, the qb and o-line one and you want the defensive back ones because it's going to boost up majority of your squad right so here we go here we're gonna get pull an epic one right here we're gonna see what we get there it is there. Mind you, all this I got for free just complete my daily objectives. I just let them save up and when I get enough, I make this video for you guys to show you guys how I got them for free. And if I want a quick sell that, look at that. That's 55K coins, right? But that, that boosts up the middle linebacker, free safety and strong safety. So once again, if you just want to boost up your middle linebacker, your free safety and strong safety, then this is one of the ones you're going to use right here. But like I said, the, the ones that I showed you to me are the best ones. So I was able to pull that. Now, let me go ahead and... Uh, Go like that, adjust that real quick. I want to take you to the auction house because I want to show you. I, I don't know why it does that. Let me go like this. It automatically did that. Like it just like st stuck on that. So that's fine because I'm, I'm going to do this anyway. I'm going to go to the, this here. So I want to show you guys, if you guys like, for instance, want to get these, but you don't have that much coins, I'm going to show you some discounted ones to do. And then quality, I'm going to go ahead and go epic. Even though they already got the epic, it don't even change it, right? And I'm going to show you guys the second best one to use if you guys want to put it on your squad. It's basically going to be this, the same one as the legendary one, but it's going to be the uh, the epic version. So where is it at? It's going to be... Where is it at? Man? I don't know why I don't show it. Oh, here we go. Oh. Yeah, this can't be... It can't be for going for that much. Is the legendary ones going for that much? No, no, hold on, hold on. Let's go to legendary real quick, right? Cause these went up they were actually cheaper so they're 198 so the legendary actually the, the, they were actually like 500k before so they went down a little bit so these are actually not bad so the other ones are about 100k so people they're actually down down lower just to let you that's why i had to make sure make sure this wasn't a glitch right so i wish i could push the qb in but it won't let me i have to go over here and uh if we see in the zone one that's, that's what you're gonna want so basically when it comes to these epic ones you're gonna want to let let it rip and in the zone for your dbs right that's what i use some of you guys will use other little different ones but to me them are the best ones to use for your squad especially if you want like a, a budget one here look at it look at you got this uh cornerback it boosts up your cornerback and your free safety only the other one boosts up the legendary one boosts up all your defensive backs but this is going to be the second best one in my opinion it's going to boost up your cornerbacks and free safety it's 89k not bad um and this is all you're going to get when it is going to be plus three man plus three play rec and one uh one press now for your QB. This is the O-line one, which I, I have used before. Where's the QB one at? It's like the QB one seems like to be the, the hardest one to find. I wish that was a... Oh, here it is. Here. Let it rip. So I guess it is going for 123K. Not bad, but I'm going to be honest with you. If you're going to spend 123K with it, you might as well just get the legendary one. But if you have to, you only have, you don't have that much coins and you want to be able to get both, then you could get this one and in the zone one and you, you'll at least be able to boost up your squad, right? But check it out. It boosts up your QB O-line 
um, plus two throw power, plus three impact blocking, and plus three, uh, plus two deep accuracy. So once again, to me, in my opinion, the first best ones are going to be your legendary in the zone and let it rip. The second best is going to be the epic one, um, let it rip and in the zone. And then if you guys don't care about those when it comes to your QB or your O-line, I mean, I'm sorry, your QB or defensive backs, and you only want like your D-line boosted up or just your O-line boosted up, then you guys could go around and just look for those strategy cards also. But once again, in my opinion, the best ones are the ones that I named. And if you guys want to get them for free, then be patient, complete your daily objectives, let them stack up and complete the sets. But if you guys don't want to wait, you guys, you guys can snipe them out the auction house and get the best ones for your squad because they go up and down. So if you guys want to snipe them, you guys go ahead and snipe them. But anyways, there it is there. If you guys like seeing what we've seen, drop a like on the video. If you guys need to subscribe to the channel, there will be more great, amazing content coming your way. Thank you guys all for tuning in. I'm out.